everyone. So this is my final wrap up for the Christmas Losers Challenge. I can't believe um, it's the end of it already. It feels like it flew by so quickly. Um, and it's been quite the journey, I have to say. Um, I can't thank Jess enough for putting on this challenge because it really motivated me to get to my goals, you know, to my dream goal. And um, I just, I'm so grateful to her. Um, and I'm happy to report that I did lose this week. And I, um, my goal for this challenge, my goal was to reach my goal weight, which was originally 132 pounds. And I'm happy to say that I weighed in this week on Monday, which is my usual weigh-in day, at 128.9 pounds. I, I can't even explain to you the feeling of reaching my dream goal and going beyond it. Like, I'm so excited. I don't even know how to express it because I'm still trying to actually um, like let it sink in and actually realize that it actually happened because I've been overweight for my entire adult life and this is the first time that I'm actually feeling thin and fit and healthy. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna put in the picture here of 128.9 pounds. So again, thank you Jess for putting on this challenge. Thank you everyone for your positive comments, for your motivation. I, I am so grateful to everyone. Um, you all inspire me. You all are just the best. I really do um, have a place for all of you in my heart. Um, I can't express my gratitude enough. And I'm going to still be making YouTube videos. Um, just because I reached my dream goal doesn't mean that I'm going to stop because I need to start and learn now how to maintain this weight. And um, that's gonna be new. Um, oh, and just wanted a tip um, from us to give everyone. And my tip is just be mindful of what you're eating. You know, um, be gracious for the food you have. Um, and, and, you know, don't multitask. This is one thing I learned on this journey from um, Weight Watchers. Don't multitask while you're eating. Like, really be mindful of what you're eating, what you're putting in your body, how you're nourishing your body. And be um, conscious about the portion that you're putting on your plate. One thing I do is I make sure that um, the stuff on my plate, my food on my plate is never touching. So there's, you know, enough portions of everything on my plate. So I have my veggies and, uh, you know, whatever, my proteins. But I make sure that I don't overdo it and I just make sure um, they're all portioned out. And um, I know most of you know that already, but it is something that has helped me on this journey and has helped me get to my goal weight. Um, and good luck to everyone on their continued success. We're going to do awesome in the new year. You know, we're going to just keep moving on. For those of you um, who are just, you know, starting this, um, you know, good luck. And I'll be there to support everyone. That's my plan. Um, and I'm actually going to put in a couple pictures of body shots of me because I haven't done that in a long time. So I'm going to throw a couple in at the end here. And um, again, thanks everyone. And thanks, Jess, for for everything. I, I so appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.